Seashell and the clergyman, I've played for many times, more times with my band, my old band, the, um, the Black Cat Orchestra. I, I um, wrote a score uh, for this probably eight-piece band with um, my husband, Kyle, who's an accordionist, and some other people. And uh, I did a ton of research on it uh, when we first did it, and it was probably 1996 or something. And the research was really juicy. It was great research because the surrealists were so um, crabby and argumentative. And they, there was tons of fighting about it. But the, um, the, um, the big fight was about the, that um, uh, Germain du Lac, was, it was made in France in 1926, I think, or 28. And um, she was this, um, uh, you know, lesbian, feminist, surrealist filmmaker. And she wrote this film with Antonin Artaud. And then Artaud went to, um, I guess, Denmark to be in Carl Dreyer's film, Passion of Joan of Arc, which I've also played for many times. And perhaps unbeknownst to him, Germain Delac shot the film and while he was away and he hated it and he you know, denounced it and there were endless nasty essays or whatever written about whether, you know, so I think the surreal, the capital S surrealists don't consider it a surrealist film because Sartel hated it. But, um, it's a great film. It's very, uh, I mean, I won't tell you how to see it, I guess, but it's I, very, um, has a, strikes a great balance, I think, between being creepy and funny and very, very subversive. I, I, when I first saw it in the late 80s or something, it, I was really excited about how um, viciously anti-authoritarian it is. So.